But I think overall the public's confidence in, in GPHC has really grown. We see it. We see the kind of uh, clientele, if I may say, the patients coming in. They are across the, 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 the demographics with regards to persons, the places they come, the, the social backgrounds and so on. And I believe that the, the um, confidence in the services we provide to the Guyanese populace is one that has really been raised with regards to standards. And um, we are working to ensure through our quality systems, we have well-established quality systems in our laboratory and tests and fields and those areas, but we're working to bring quality systems across all our areas of services to ensure that we are not only given good standard, but we are able to recognize where gaps exist and where we can actually improve. We've done the first breast reconstruction surgery for a person who had had a mastectomy for cancer. We've done uh, our first sustainable program for Smile Train, uh, meaning that we have introduced a sustainable program for uh, fixing of cleft lip and palates in children. And we have commenced, we have recommenced cardiac surgeries for, for our pediatric patients who for several years were not getting the service in country and had to go abroad to get the uh, surgeries. We have introduced also first and then sustainably service that gives all our kidney stone sur uh, surgeries being done endoscopically, meaning that patients do not have to have a cut on their uh, abdomen or torso to get uh, these stones out. We've also done uh, first of re removal of a caudal tail as a child that was born with a human tail. Um, that was done with reconstruction of the area to ensure that the spinal column is closed. And we've done uh, others including laparoscopic surgery with ICT ICG technology. This is where we light up this fluorescence uh, technology that lights up the vessels and the drainage within the area such as the liver making surgery, complex surgeries, a lot more safer and more feasible. So these are just a number of new things that we are doing. But what I wanted to emphasize here is that these are first, but they are not one-offs. We are trying in all of these cases um, with success in building services that offer these surgeries in a sustainable manner to the population. And in that regard, there are several examples. Um, our bariatric service, which started just about three years ago with its first surgery, now has a thriving bariatric component, our clinic, where patients who are uh, obese and have tried everything else um, and they so qualify can actually get surgeries. And these surgeries are life altering in that it is now proven that they, uh, persons with um, conditions that come out of obesity, including diabetes and other endocrine disease, when they have these surgeries, invariably they're cured of these diseases. Um, transplant surgery is another area in which we, we have moved from just sporadic cases in the mid 2000s to late 2000s and we now have, we now have a program that boasts of the best um, transplant per million persons in the region. We, uh, we, our numbers are way ahead of any of our um, regional partners. We now offer vascular surgeries for, for um, conditions including aortic aneurysms that previously if someone had it, it was either a death sentence or you had to find a pathway outside of the country for those persons to get surgery. Many of these surgeries are the first in Guyana. They may have been done in the region. Um, some of them are first for the region. We have not gone the length of certifying, uh, uh, validating whether they are first in the region. So many of it is done through our local, well, our experts, our specialists who have gone, received training, or trained inherently within our system. And several others have been done, are being done with partnerships. So for very high, complex, resource intensive um, services or, and requirements for surgeries, for example, scoliosis surgeries the, the, in, in aligning the backbone in, in a linear manner. Um, such surgeries are done with partners. We have partners, uh, world pediatric partners, 
Um, we have Goalie Gift of Life, who partner, partners with us for our cardiac pediatric surgeries. Um, we do partner with, uh, um, I believe that what we are on the path to doing, of doing is uh, building sensors or areas of excellence in clinical care, in surgery, in other areas. And it's not just surgery. There are other areas in which we, non-surgical areas in which we have built capacity and we're doing work that is very, very successful comparatively to the rest of the region and even abroad.